Samantha Coates, your Blitz book series is now best-selling on a, on a global scale. What made you first want to start writing theory books? Well, it started because I was writing theory worksheets for my students all the time. I wasn't really happy with any of the textbooks that were around. I found them either very formal or that they didn't explain concepts well enough or both. And so I always used to write my own material. And then after I'd written about a zillion worksheets for my students, an idea popped into my head that, well, maybe I could write a book and it wouldn't need to be formal. We could have an informal theory book. It could even have jokes. And it could maybe be like a, a theory for dummies type uh, series that, that would invite people to want to use them. Uh, and so then I got the idea that it could be uh, like a how to pass grade one theory, but we'll cross out the pass and we'll have a word that means much more than pass your exams. And the word blitz popped into my head. Uh, and then it, the idea just grew from there and I started writing grades one to five in Australia and I made sure that they had humor in them. So kids learn much more when they're having a bit of fun when if there's the odd joke that makes them laugh, they're going to retain that concept a lot more. And they're extremely popular in Australia and now you've tailored a lot of them for the UK market. What has that involved? That has involved pretty much rewriting grades one to five for the ABRSM syllabus. Yeah. So the syllabus had some similarities to the Australian syllabus, but enough differences that the books need to be totally rewritten. However, they're still in the same very conversational, user-friendly style. And somebody in a recent review actually said that it sounds like, th this book is written in a way that it sounds like it's an older brother or sister who's already done the, the work explaining it to their younger sibling, oh. which I was really chuffed to read that review because that's exactly what I was aiming for in the style. Yeah. Okay. And there's a lot, as well as the books, there's a lot of content online, I think. How have you done that and how does it relate to the, the books themselves? Yes, it was very important to me to have a supporting website that is an educational resource for students and teachers. So sometimes when you're limited to a 70 or 80 page book, you just can't cover everything properly. So uh, I really value that at the end of a page on intervals, if I feel that there haven't been quite as many examples there as I would have liked, I can just say, go to the Blitz Books website and download more worksheets on intervals. It's all completely free and available for students and teachers. And the feedback is that people find that really helpful.